What is happening everybody? Welcome back to Dark Horse Sports Cards. You got Brody here for another exciting video. Today we are jumping into the Absolute Football Mega Boxes. We have not had great success with the blasters, so we're moving up to these bad boys. I want to say I got these for $49.99 at Walmart. They are reselling for crazy prices right now. I don't know why people are spending that much money on them, but you can get one autograph or one mem card out of here. We're probably going to get Panini points, so I am prepared for it. 42 cards per box. We're also going to be looking for the black parallels, but really this is what we're after up here, folks. We are after the kabooms and the explosive inserts. On the back, you can see that there are a decent amount of numbered cards. We have actually pulled the red, white, and blue kaleidoscope before. You can pull some mem cards that are numbered from uh, 99 to 49, tools of the trade. But again, the kaboom horizontal and the explosive is what we're really after. But I wanted to open this today just to kind of see like, are these mega boxes any better than the blasters? Because we have seen enough of the blasters at this point to realize they're no good. So could there be anything better in this box for us? And you might be asking yourself, where's Kelsey? Why isn't she here? She tapped out. I asked her, hey, I'm opening up these new mega boxes. Do you want to rip some? And she said, absolutely not. I will rip the hangers. She wants prism hangers. We'll put that back there. So you just got me. We're going to war. All right. War is not a place for women. It's a place for men. And that's what we're going. I'm losing my voice. <coughs> I'm already there. Right. Look at me. I'm in shambles. <coughs> I know I'm about to get dominated. But it is what it is. Here we go. First pack. Boys. Prepare. Prepare for the worst. Expect to get destroyed. Here we go. Starting off the rip with... Deontay Johnson, Raheem Mozart. Uh, let me push these back a little bit. We got a little more room here. There we go. Odell Beckham Jr. Our first rookie is going to be Mackay Blackman. Then we're going to have a Darnell Wright. And we hit, oh my gosh. We hit a red, white, and blue. Wow. Wow. Is this numbered? No, I don't think this is numbered. This is just the red, white, and blue kaleidoscope. First pack, red, white, and blue kaleidoscope on the Brock Purdy. Now, unfortunately, he did not win the Super Bowl. <laughs> this card would be uh, a little bit of a higher value right now if he did end up actually winning the Super Bowl. But that's okay. That's okay. Still a very cool, sweet, it's very good hit. Very nice. All right, our first black parallel. And as you can see, it's just literally right there and right there. That's the only difference. I don't, I don't know. They got to do something different to get my attention, I think, next year. Because, I mean, I'll still rip it. I'll rip anything. I'll definitely try anything once. Well, most things once. Uh, we have our mem card here, too. Okay. Did it say or? One autograph or mem card? Dang. Okay, so I guess we're getting a mem card here and no autograph. Derrick Henry, Aaron Rodgers, Marquise Brown. There's a nice Bijan Robinson there. Steve Aviala. Okay, we'll pull from the back. Kid Reporter. We've got one more back here. Tajay Spears on the black. Okay, it's not too bad. And our mem is Brees Hall. There it is, Brees Hall, and what does that say? Absolute burners, absolute burners, Brees Hall. Interesting. All right, not from any specific game or event. Cool looking card though. So I guess this is one that, I mean, I, I guess you can get this numbered potentially, but all right. Brees Hall, cool looking card. We'll sleeve up our black Tajay Spears here. And uh, we'll throw a sleeve on Bijan because we do respect the rookies. 
I don't think these are going to be anything crazy, but we can throw them on there as well. All right, Tajay there. I guess we'll throw these up there too. Might as well. We got them back there. Might as well throw them up there. I also, I don't know how I look, but we've added an extra light in the back shooting on the product. So hopefully that looks a little bit better. Hopefully the cards look crisper. The light on the back also looks better. We're getting all, always changing stuff, trying to make it better for you guys. Daniel Jones here. Austin Eckler. Kenny Pickett. We're going to have a Marvin Mims. Broncos. We've got Garrett Williams in his Syracuse jersey. Ooh, we have a Will Levis. Will Levis on the by storm. All right. I am a fan of this insert. If there is one good thing about this product, it would be the Will Levis. And our black is going to be Isaiah Hodgins. All right. We continue to push. Continue to push. Does Absolute have anything for us? I'm wearing my Gators hat, hopefully to try to get some good vibes going with Anthony Richardson. I'm not even asking for CJ Stroud. Robert Woods, Stevenson. We have a Stetson Bennett, a Dylan Horton. Another back, nope, not a backwards card. Just an interesting black card mixed in there. Miles Sanders, all right. Fair enough. Is this worth two blasters? Probably. Is it worth um the price point absolutely not i think that's i think this is a better product than the blasters but it's still a bad product and still overpriced comparative to what else we've pulled this year this definitely just doesn't it is just a kaboom or bust product but i want to hit kaboom so bad there's a Jaden reed a dj turner and cam smith on the black a rookie cam smith on the black all right last pack of this box before we move into box number two and if we do hit an explosive or if we do hit a kaboom davis mills trust me i will freak out michael wilson there's a nice puka good night you're not missing anything unfortunately it's just just a little bit more expensive, but still trash. There's a Tebow Samuel on the draft diamonds. And there's a nice Trevor Lawrence on the black. If anyone's interested. All these cards that are worth anything. This Puka, for example. These will all be up on our eBay. If you're new to the channel, how this channel, channel pretty much operates. You have me and Kelsey. Kelsey is my wife. Case it, Kelsey. Um, we both rip stuff here in Dallas. Then my buddy Silver Sage, he's the one that runs all the YouTube. Uh, sorry, I run all the YouTube. He runs all the eBay and does all the financial breakdown videos. If you enjoy those, he's the one behind all that. And basically how the finances work is all the money we make off of YouTube, all the money we make off of eBay goes straight into buying more packs. And our thought process is basically like this. Right now we're losing money. So this video, for example, was probably $100, $110 or something for these two boxes. I don't think we're going to pull $110 worth of cards. And we're certainly not going to make $110 off of YouTube AdSense. But the idea is hopefully we continue to grow the channel so we make more money off of the AdSense. And if we pull bigger cards, we make more money off of YouTube. And what that allows us to do is buy nicer, more expensive boxes and also rip more. So instead of ripping two mega boxes today, maybe in the future I'm ripping three. And it gives you guys a little bit more product to look at. That is the goal. All the money we make goes straight back into the channel. So we do appreciate everyone that's supporting. And this is a good time to say too, if you're new to the channel, like and subscribe to the channel. That helps a lot. Like the video right now, it's free. It's completely free. I'm opening absolute mega boxes. What the heck am I doing? Why am I doing this? I don't know because I believe in myself. I believe that I'm going to hit something, but everyone and their mother is saying, no, you have no shot. 
You have no shot of hitting anything. And it is what it is. James Conner. We move on. Patrick Mahomes. Brian Robinson Jr. Matthew Stafford. Another Stetson Bennett. Another Dylan Horton. An Aaron Rodgers on the black. And a Kid Reporter. We do have some of the target. Absolute Megas. I think that's it. I don't... I Guys, I have a hard time saying I'm going to open any more Absolute. We have... One more mega here from Walmart, and we have three from Tart. Oh my gosh, I just had I just freaked out. The shine off this light, it's it's adding more shine, and I oh my gosh, I thought I thought my heart just stopped for a second. I thought we might have did it right there, guys. I thought we might have did it right there. Wow. But what I was saying is we basically have that was two black parallels. Very interesting. We we basically are going to have another video where we'll see. Maybe I can convince Kelsey to open the target mega the target mega boxes. I don't know. We might do a box battle between me and Kelsey and the target mega boxes. And then the final video will be Target versus Walmart. And I think absolute will be done for us this year. There's too many other products. There's a nice Bijan. There's too many other products that are good. Ooh, Aiden O'Connell on the Mim. Yes, please. Okay. That's clean. I mean, I guess, right? Arm. Aiden. I don't know. What does arm mean? Um, just pretty basic. I mean, it looks it looks clean. But it is a very basic looking card. There's no actual name to this one. So, I don't know. We do get a black Puka though. And that right there is most likely our best card. The black Puka. I have no idea what the going rate is for the black inserts in this product. The parallels of people actually... I said inserts, I meant parallels. If people actually care about them, I'm not entirely sure. But, like I was saying, there's way too much good stuff to rip right now to be ripping absolute. I'm just a madman. That's why you watch this channel, because I'm a madman. Or you probably actually have watched it to watch Kelsey hit case hits, let's be honest. All right, Travis Kelsey, Jonathan Taylor, Tua. See, I have to look. Is that black? I don't think it is. I think that's just normal. Jaden Reed here. DJ Turner. And a Michael Wilson. Black Michael Wilson. All right. We are down to our final pack. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of this product. Do you think the Mega Box is any better? Any better than the Blasters? I'm having a hard time believing that. This feels very similar. I feel just as depressed opening the Mega Boxes as I do opening the Blasters. We are hitting tons of Pukas. We do hit a Kenny Pickett stargazing. And we're going to finish it off with a Marquise Brown. We did hit a lot of Pukas though. So that was nice. No Stroud. Got a nice Brock Purdy. I'll kind of show you guys the highlights right here. We got a Puka, we got our Bryce Hall, uh, Absolute Burners, an Aiden O'Connell, another Puka. This one, it's so hard to tell if it's black or not. I don't think this one is black. And then a nice black Trevor Lawrence. We have a By Storm Will Levis. We have a, a red, white, and blue Kaleidoscope, Kaleidoscope Brock Purdy. And we finish it off with a black Puka. We also had a Cam Smith Puka right here that was hiding, but that's going to do it for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I don't know, man. Absolute might just be absolute trash. And that unfortunately might be the name of the game. Until next time, keep ripping them packs.